Hey, hey, all right. So what have we got? Something I made some time ago. This is polystyrene, but it's an interesting scenario. Please familiar with the repulsion types thing. Um, the uh, Who's familiar with the repulse on? The layout configuration is fucking just about spot on that this ring is where the turbine sits. In the shape of this turbine, depending on how it's blowed upon, Blowing. I'll stick that one here, I agree. Alright. So what we've done is on the impeller, the annula has been uh, turbined. So now the force is being applied back onto itself at a smaller diameter. That's what we're trying to do here. To grab as much of the potential energy as you can at a smaller diameter so it's a higher rotation speed so that's what we're doing yeah right. i have tested this concept in this turbine before and it did increase the coupling even with a standard blade angle. So, uh, I know it definitely uh, has an effect. So the returning flow, it's got actually going to act on both sides. I'm going to leave that open, there's a gap between them. Just let it flow over both sides. Setting this one forwards, it is the slower of the two, but I don't want this ridiculous high stall. I want to see what it does like this first. Because uh, as far as stall goes, or spool you could call it as well, is uh, in my opinion it wastes engine power, um, doesn't couple well. And uh, yeah, just revs the shit out of the engine. You know, it's not what we want. We want to be uh, accelerating the vehicle or the load um, strongly. All right. All good. It's going down. Cheers.